Hello and welcome. I am the Suit and Tie Dip and Shoe Guy and this is the number 39 short format review. So, Skull Long Cut Cherry Tobacco Blend. What is it? Taking a look at the can, you have the standard skull layout. The silver outline of the word skull is raised. This half circle is raised and the raised boxed rim of U.S. smokeless products. The center is a metallic cherry red, fire engine red if you would. In between the boxed rim and the inner circle that is a gunmetal gray. Warning label is in black. Going around you have general information up here in small. It's 100 percent American tobacco as is all U.S. smokeless products. It is smokeless tobacco. It's against the law to sell to kids like people under the age of oh, 21 and sale is only allowed in the United States. Then you have cut flavor and small branding. You have barcode and manufacturers information. Then you have cut again and large branding. So the manufacturer's information is this is a standard 1.2 net weight ounce can. It is tax class M as is all dip. Um, it is a product of the U.S. Smokeless Tobacco Company, which is headquartered in Nashville, Tennessee. All right. On the back, you have a U.S. Smokeless stamped fresh can, guaranteed fresh, sorry. And the, wow, that's a sell by April 12th, 2020 in laser print. So I'm going to cut right into it. I have not had this product for a while. It came into my line of thought the other night when I did the dip first chew review. I will be touching on what the connection there is, obviously. Opening the can up. A dark wild cherry smell with noticeable dark fire tobacco underneath it okay so looking in the can that is pretty dead on actually there is an inconsistency or two in it it's fairly consistent though in cut and there is a tinge of brown but it's pretty dark stuff the moisture level is good for, for a skull product. So I'll get some out. It's got the skull cut. And, and that's why I always tell people if, that are like just starting out, go with a skull product. All right. There are things I don't like about skull personally, but for ease of use, it's one of the best pinching products. So I'm going to throw this in and hit the pause button. So, what is it, you ask? It is a cherry flavored, like a dark, wild cherry flavored, dark fire tobacco dip. That, that's what it is. Um, now, if you don't like cherry, obviously don't go buy the cherry skull. All right. If you do like cherry, you may want to give it a try. It is not candy like. In my, my opinion, is not candy night like. The reason for that is the cherry is sort of dark itself, but there is a noticeable dark fire tobacco flavor underneath it. Okay? It registers a little bit in the smell, but definitely in the taste. I'm not saying it's not sweet. I suppose it is, but... It's not something you're going to put in your mouth and go, oh, wow, that's, that's really sweet. No, it's not. Okay. Now, the cut is good, as I said. 
and the packaging, it looks all right. I mean, you know, it, it, it doesn't look bad, let me put it that way. I, I guess it's your personal preference whether, you know, you like the color red or whatnot. Stays well formed in the mouth, okay? It's comfortable, the cut is good. These blend products, they are like second or third tier within the skull line. So there are some inconsistencies, but nothing that alters the skull pinching ability of skull, which is really good and why I suggest this stuff to people that are new. Now, there's a drawback to this though. Well, there's a drawback to someone like me. For a beginner, for a guy that's getting bowled over by nicotine and it's making him feel sick, it may not be a drawback. It may actually be a pro in the product's favor. The other night I did dip versus chew. These were dip numbers. Uh, the top one is the free nicotine of Kodiak, then Grizzly Winter Green, then Copenhagen Long Cut, then Skull Original, Skull Mint, Straight, Winter Green, and that's the number for Cherry there. It's 1.7. Okay. Kodiak Winter Green is 8.2 and Skull Cherry is 1.7. Now that Cooper would seemingly be taken off the market by Swisher, this is the lowest nicotine dip there is. All right. Hawken still has the lowest nicotine for. A product that comes in a round can but Hawken is technically chewing tobacco keep that in mind so the nicotine is really low but I hear all the time on different platforms guy new guys saying young guys you know I'm getting sick I can only keep it in so long well if you like cherry or can deal with cherry this might be it then short of that if you don't like cherry I believe it is slightly stronger but skull peach you get the skull cut yeah it's a little fruity but not like overblown sweet candy like all right the pinchability is great the nicotine is lower you're you're you're, you're going to be hard pressed to get sick uh if you do get sick from something like this then you may want to rethink think whether you should be dipping or not and i'm not i'm not cutting on anybody i'm being serious all right so good cut nice packaging all right, low nicotine, flavor's all right if you like cherry. This has been the What Is It review of Skull Cherry Tobacco Blend Long Cut. I am the Student Tie Dip and Chew Guy. I do hope you all are well. Do take care of yourselves, and God bless.